here with another video from grabgreattraffic.com and in this one we're going to show you how to work uh, with HTML templates in setting up your website. Uh, we would like to avoid uh, going through and doing the links on each page individually so we're going to do like a little master page and uh, the first thing we want to do is open up our uh, index.html that we copied over into our new project form uh, uh, folder and from the uh, left nav uh, folder that we downloaded when we signed up for our grabgreattraffic.com newsletter so let's hit control O in this tab and as you can see I've already created a contact page and a privacy page uh, but we're going to open up the index page this will be our home page and the first thing that we want to do is probably eliminate a lot of the content so it'll make it easier when we insert our unique content in each page so let's uh, hold the shift key down and then hit delete give ourselves a little space with the enter key and this is going to be kind of our uh, master page here we're going to hit control s to save this and uh, we haven't put a, a website title yet and that's one of the first things that we want to do uh, let's go up here and go down to page title and properties and our title is going to be save the donkeys we are donkey activists and we are going to put up a site on saving uh, the donkeys so this will be uh, our home page will be save the donkeys and for our description we'll put in uh, a site dedicated to preserving our national donkey heritage and then we'll come down here and hit OK and now if you look up here we've uh, saved the donkeys as our title of our page and uh, so we'll want to let's go ahead and give ourselves a little more room here go uh, hit the enter key and let's put save the donkeys for our title page and every page that we create uh, later on we're going to uh, be sure and, and put a title in it so that when we check the links we'll we can see which page that we're on so this is going to be save the donkeys and let's Hold the shift key down, select this, and go up to our little color chart here. Make it red. Hit OK. And we'll also notice that we have a heading one tag for our title. And like I said before, we want to avoid having to go in and do links for every page. So uh, we don't have those pages yet, but we're going to have to, in the links here, we're going to have to just type in so our our home page of course is going to be our index page so let's go up to links and we could probably go in this way if we wanted to and open up the page and 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 double click this but what we want to do here is show you how to we're going to type in index dot HTML and this is going to be our home page and we don't want to open a link in a new window as long as there are navigation to other pages now for our contact page down here and our privacy policy probably open up another window but uh, just going from web page to web page probably you don't want to open up another window so this is our, our link and we'll hit OK and these others here aren't links yet but they soon will be uh, page two is going to be catch donkeys and 
and now let's hold the shift key down and select it go up to our link and our page is going to be of course catch donkeys dot html and we'll hit OK and our next link is going to be raise donkeys and hold the shift key down or we could click and drag either one we'll click and drag go up to our link and type in raise donkeys dot html and we come down here and hit OK now let's go ahead and eliminate these other potential links and hit delete let's give ourselves a little more room here and if you wanted to of course you can hit the enter key and give yourself more room between the links should you want to but we don't want to do that uh, we'll leave them scrunched up a little bit like that and now uh, we have all of the links to our pages and in our next uh, video we're going to show you how to use the save as command up here and we're going to create pages for each one of these and then of course as soon as we do that we're going to change the title and then we'll go up here to format for each page and do the page title and properties then we'll save it and then uh, use the save as command that will save that page like like we wanted it now we will use the save as command and we'll go in and create each page so hope we uh, see you in the next video and thanks for watching